Hello, my name is Tom Francie with the University of Nebraska-Lincoln Extension and I want to talk to you about designing your residential rain garden. To determine your rain garden size you need three pieces of information. The soil infiltration rate in your yard, the slope of your yard where you're going to place your rain garden, and the roof area draining to your downspout that feeds water to your rain garden. Let me illustrate how to calculate that roof drainage area. This is the downspout we're going to drain to our rain garden. We'll change the direction of this downspout and run it into our yard. So above you can see the gutter that collects the water from the roof. This is the length we want to measure to calculate our area. Ben, please hold this even with that end of the gutter. Use a tape measure from the ground. Don't climb up on the roof to do this measurement and estimate the length of this gutter. That's 16 feet. Now we'll go around to the other side of the house and measure the width. Now on the side of the house, we want to measure the length from the peak of the roof to our rain gutter on this side. That's the area of the roof that drains to the rain gutter. We can do this from the ground. We don't want to measure the length of the roof, but the area on the ground, the bird's eye view that the roof covers. So Ben, hold that even with the peak of the roof, and I'll measure this length right out to my rain gutter. And that's 16 feet. So 16 feet measured times the length gives you the area that drains to this downspout which will run to our rain garden. That's our first calculation.